The Fight Eagle Ranch in Burleson County in Texas is the battleground against the fire ant. Entomologist Charles Barr with Texas Cooperative Extension Services said in May of 2002, approximately 3,000 forage flies were released in a 300-acre area. Uh, the basic idea is to treat once per year with broadcast baits to knock down fire ants. And that costs 10 to $15 per acre per year, and that's simply unaffordable. So what we're trying to do is do these treatments and then release biological control agents, uh, the forward fly and Thelahania in particular, and hopefully they will help keep the fire ant populations down, prevent reinvasion. Dr. Barr explained the forward fly is a natural predator for the fire ant. Both originated from South America, and when the fire ant was accidentally imported to the United States, the forward fly was left behind. The need to control the fire ant population has called for the reintroduction of the fire ant to its natural enemy. Uh, what the fly does is it hovers down very, very close to the ant and lays an egg in the ant's leg joint. The egg hatches, uh, the larva then eats its way up to the ant's head and the ant becomes paralyzed in the process. And then when the larva pupates, uh, the ant's head falls off and a few weeks later that uh, uh, pupa emerges as an adult and it goes about its business. According to the entomologist, the forest fly eliminates two to three percent of the ant's colony since a single female forest fly can lay about 200 eggs. Ants recognize these flies when they start hovering around them and they, uh, they stop doing what they do best which is forage for food. Uh, they stop, they protect themselves, they cluster together, they, they go hide under leaves. Uh, so by introducing these flies, we're hoping to kind of swing the natural balance back to the way things are supposed to be. Dr. Barr assured the release of the forest fly species will not have any negative effects in our environment. He said the flies have been carefully screened and it will be unlikely that they will switch to any other ant species causing <clears throat> problems in our environment. From College Station, Texas, I'm Norma Moreno.